And thanks for visiting us this morning at arklatexhomepage.com. I'm meteorologist Josh Marses with your Friday morning forecast update. We are starting out your Friday morning. A few showers and some isolated thunderstorms as well. Still not expecting that we'll see any severe weather, but we will see this rain and thunderstorm activity on and off through the day as a cold front is now approaching from our northwest. We'll actually stay uh, ahead of the front for much of the day, so most of us will make it into the 70s, maybe squeezing out uh, a little sunshine here and there. But if you're not seeing rain, it will be mostly cloudy to overcast. But if you have any outdoor plans today, uh, definitely take an umbrella with you as we are looking at this on and off, not only today, but through tonight and tomorrow as well, as this front will stall just south of the region. So your temperature is right around 60 degrees in most locations this morning. Uh, mentioned that warm up ahead of the front will have similar highs to what we've experienced the past two days or so, anywhere from the low 70s in Texarkana to the mid 70s in Shreveport, and actually could push 80 degrees in Natchitoches today. Uh, severe storm risk, really no change from the Storm Prediction Center from what they were showing us yesterday. The expected uh, stronger storms will be down to the southwest of us. I'm not entirely convinced we won't see anything strong here. So if you're across East Texas, potentially here it could see a few high wind gusts and maybe uh, some frequent lightning with some of these storms, but no uh, widespread or significant severe weather expected today. Uh, future cast showing again the front moving north to south. So that rain chance will shift around to East Texas and Louisiana where the uh, rain threat will be a little bit higher as we head through the afternoon and evening today. Notice it's not an all day rain. The thunderstorm activity is not too widespread, but it will continue uh, at times as we move through the day Saturday. Here's a look at Saturday morning. Saturday afternoon, it looks like another pretty good push of rain and maybe even a few thunderstorms, but we're not in the severe weather outlook for your Saturday as well. And you see the rain uh, starting to taper off a bit Sunday morning. If you have outdoor plans, uh, some trying to get out of the house this weekend, Sunday is definitely the better of the two days to do that. We'll average maybe one inch of rain across most of the region between now and Sunday night, but we may see some spots that pick up an isolated two inches or so in future cash so in the uh, potential for that a little bit higher across the i-20 corridor and active weather for the next seven to ten days i do think we'll get a break from the rain sunday or temperatures tomorrow in the 60s and low 70s big warm-up headed our way next week showers and storms again monday tuesday looks like we'll kind of dry out for a day wednesday which we could push 90 degrees and then we'll have to watch late next week into easter weekend looks like a very active pattern setting up we'll have to watch the late week time frame for maybe a few strong to severe storms and in addition to some more heavier rainfall setting up potentially late next week.